like I'm looking at your lipstick in your dress, though, and I wish I had green lipstick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why a mistake. You, let me just a get some green, green, yeah. green lipstick in here. <laughs> 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 oh, I can already almost turquoise. Yeah. Look at those. Very beautiful. It brings out the blue. Well, thank you guys for coming. Um, I think we have here Arnold Palmer, right? This drink? Arnold Palmer. Yes, bro. Arnold Palmer. Arnold Palmer. <laughs> so it's tradition for us to cheers. Oh, so right. let's Fantastic. cheers. Look at me in the eye and cheers. Yeah, we have to look right. at each other in the eyes. Cheers. It's very cheers. creepy and we like it like that. Cheers. Cheers, Damon. Cheers. 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 A drink connoisseur, right? I try. Besides, I try. besides being a drink connoisseur, Jane, I know that you run a website. Yep. An amazing blog. Called The Hairpin. Yep. Yeah. And how did um, you get started on it? Well, uh, my friend Edith Zimmerman started it a couple years ago. And it's just like a general interest, fun blog. Mainly aimed at women, but we talk about all kinds of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, Does yeah. Hairpin make videos as well? Yep. Yeah. Oh. I do beauty Q and A. Is this on videos. YouTube? It's on YouTube and Vimeo. Yeah. It's in our world. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> We're in. Mine are super basic, though. You guys, I'm, mine tried. are yeah, like, <laughs> if you're in your, you know, 20s or 30s and you've never worn makeup before, but mm -hmm. you're a little bit curious. That's kind of like my audience. When so, did you start wearing makeup? Oh. My, sorry, mom. Uh, when I was like 12, I was sneaking on the bus, That's and I had bad. A, I had an hour-long bus ride to school. I know, but I was strictly forbidden. Oh, we're long. Oh my yeah. god, I lived in the middle of nowhere. Done makeup, do something. Makeup, to change my whole outfit and yeah. everything. <laughs> you change your outfit? Yeah, I would just completely change my clothes and my makeup and and put tons of makeup on and then like stash the bag. Was that like your bag. alter ego? It was who I really wanted to be. It's, it's it's like it was kind of like your way of expressing yourself. Exactly. Right? Makeup and fashion. Yeah. I love yeah. it. It's always been like What that. were you more into, fashion or makeup? Um, at the time, probably fashion because I could get away with it a little more than makeup. I mean, parents were very strict. They're very cool people, but at the time, they were like, yeah. but you're going to get pregnant if you keep wearing makeup. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> it just happens. Yeah, it comes with it. It's it's immediately. Put <laughs> lipstick on and you're yeah. pregnant. Yep. Um, <laughs> but my mom was a seamstress, so we got to play with clothes a lot. Oh, okay. You know, so you could go to Goodwill or whatever with no money and grab a new outfit That's and go amazing. home and change it all up. And That's, yeah. I love that. Yeah. I love that do-it-yourself, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. taking something and recycling it and turning it into something different. Yeah, I love that. It was really big back a million years ago when and I was it, a I think teenager. It's still big. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. for sure coming back with mm -hmm. people like doing all kinds of DIY projects on clothes and stuff. Because they share houses. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. 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 Like demystify it. You're like, mm -hmm. oh, I never thought of it that way. Yeah. And then you add your. Some of my favorite it. things that I read on the web are like just you know DIY projects. Like, how did I mm -hmm. make this? Yeah. Skirt I saw at Fashion Week or whatever. I get panic. Oh, I'm like, like I have to do it now. <laughs> I'll see something. You just something. drop everything you're doing, I'll right? I'll see something. It was literally like I'm like shopping on eBay trying to find that thing. I'm like I want the one that she has. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know, it's funny that you said demystifying, and which I appreciate about bloggers so much because we've lived in such a time for so many years where everything was secret. Like, mm -hmm. all of our trades were secret. Like, I couldn't tell you what lipstick I use. I couldn't tell you what hairspray I use mm -hmm. because everybody was kind of for themselves and then now I feel like bloggers like everybody everybody's so open with information mm -hmm. it's like we're it's not a, afraid of our yeah. secret we coming out share. and someone some unknown coming right. out because that's the goal of everybody mm -hmm. is to come out of I mean more people are interested in you if you're sharing rather yeah. than yeah. hiding and keeping everything to yourself mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. yeah they do they like those realistic beauty secrets yeah and I feel like the more beauty secrets you give them, the more they come to you, mm -hmm. you know? Because they're like, she's going to give me something that I can actually put to use. Mm -hmm. when, the, when you post, yeah. is it, do you post about makeup tips? Or like, do you have a specific thing that you post about? Or I mean, how does I, that work? I write every day, and I have like a number of posts that I put up every day that are just, you know, whatever I find fun that day. Um, it might be something in the news. It might be something about the Oscars. Um, but I, my regular beat is the beauty, fashion, kind of that thing. That I, and I'm, I do that maybe three or four times a week. Um, so it's either a Q&A where readers have written in about some very specific beauty right. question that they have or one of, my, one of my videos. And my goal with the videos is to answer questions that are really basic, like how do you shape an eyebrow? But keeping in mind that if people, if my viewers are like me, you might watch something like that, but not actually ever do the thing mm. that you're watching it right. for. No, no, totally. Right. Like, it's always like right. that. I watch Food Network, and I nev never yeah, cooked I'm, a thing no, from Food Network, no. but I watch it every day. I'm not going to make a it. wedding cake, you know, but I love no. watching it. I know. I so I try to keep it. that in mind, like, so that I'm having fun, and so the viewers having fun, whether or not they're actually going to use it.